Hello everybody, welcome back to Thieges Notebook Review. I'm your host, Joel Michael, and what we're doing today is upgrading the storage options on our latest review subject, the Lenovo ThinkPad P50. While reviewing the ThinkPad, I discovered that not all examples of the P50 come with the necessary parts to upgrade the storage options. Fortunately, the parts needed to insert a 2.5-inch drive are available on eBay. Unfortunately, the wrong parts are available too. Don't buy the wrong parts, which are too wide and don't work. Buy the right parts that fit and do work. To get started, take out the battery, and if you want to, press the power button a few times to get rid of any leftover charge. The screws come out with any Phillips head screwdriver and have stoppers, not the technical term, so they don't come out. Removing this bottom cover the first time was kind of a pain, I would greatly recommend a sufficient prying tool. With that off, the easiest way to insert the drive is to plug it into the SATA adapter first, then place the drive into the caddy. There are little stubs that go into the screw holes, again not a technical term, on the side of the drive. Word of caution, mine didn't fit very well, and you may want to shave them a bit, or off, whatever you want to do. It has guide flaps that fit over the drive and it'll fit nice and snug into the bay regardless. A little too snug in this case. Once in place, connect the adapter to the SATA port. It should click firmly and securely, taking quite a bit of prying in order to release again. Once connected, replace the bottom cover, preferably without a hump. In this case, it doesn't seem to wa want to... Okay, you know what? New rule, f*** the caddy, we don't need it. Look at all this foam around the drive, we'll be fine. The caddy would probably work better with an actual SSD anyway because those dimensions are slightly smaller. With the SSD firmly secured in the case thanks to the abundant foam, replace the bottom cover and connect the battery. Boot to Windows, then please reserve your panic if Windows doesn't immediately find your drive. If it's brand new, it actually shouldn't see it yet. Right click on the start button, then left click on disk management. You should see a box on the bottom with a black header and a certain amount of GBs of unallocated space. Right click on the box, then select New Simple Volume to start the wizard. If all you do is click Next, Windows will set up the drive with the maximum amount of available space and the subsequent available drive letter. And then, voila, we have more space to put crap. Yay! This has been a tutorial on how to install a 2.5-inch drive in the Lenovo ThinkPad P50. If I did a good job explaining the process, give me a like. If I sucked it up and left out a bunch of details, let me know in the comments below. Also, go ahead and click subscribe for more great PC how-tos in the future. Thanks for watching and you guys, have a good night.